What's up, Desire Beauties? It's your girl here, back with another video. I am so excited. For one, it's a spring look. I love spring. Not only that, my birthday is this month. I cannot wait. I'm gonna be 28 years old. I'm getting up there. That's two years away from 30. But I'm, I'm really getting up there. Like, I'm really getting old. But I have a lot that I do wanna accomplish before I do approach my 30, so I'm definitely gonna be making sure I'm grinding it out and doing what I gotta do to reach those goals. Um, definitely growing my YouTube channel is one of my main goals, so definitely if you like the videos, definitely support, like, comment, and subscribe for me. Um, it'll really, really help me out. Anyways, though, if you guys wanna see this look, then just keep watching. All right, so of course this is the spring look, so we are gonna go ahead and start with the brows. But like my boyfriend got me some flowers. They are so cute and just bright and pretty and springy. I'm just so ready for spring. Um, I cannot find my Fenty brow brush. I hate my nails. But I cannot wait because I'm getting them done for my birthday. I'm getting my eyebrows, just all the good stuff. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and brush them up. Not only is it my birthday month, it's about to be spring. It's also about to be daylight saving or whichever one that when it's like later, it seems like when it's late, but it's still bright outside, that one. <laughs> but um, yeah, I'm excited about that too. The way the sun is just like beaming. Okay, sis. So the brows is done. I apologize for the lighting. So I am gonna go in with this Zulu palette here uh, by Javius Place. And I'm actually gonna go in with the, excuse my dirty palette. And I'm gonna go in with this yellow shade right here. You can use any yellow shade that you have, but this is the yellow shade that I am gonna go with. I don't know what happened to this color right here, but you can use concealer if you want to as well. But I'm going in with the P. Louise base. I stand by this base.
color and I'm gonna go in with that yellow. I'm just bringing that, this is gonna be my transition color. makeup while I'm updating but it's okay so I feel like the yellow is definitely packed on all right so I'm gonna go in with this orange shade and then I'm also gonna go in with this pink shade here I'm gonna mix these two shades together for the crease Going back in with the yellow to blend it out, to blend out the edges a little bit there. I'm gonna go ahead and do the other eye off camera. All right, y'all, so I went ahead and did that off camera. My other eye, I'm just gonna make sure everything is really nicely blended in there. I'm not gonna do any other cutting of the crease today. All right, so next I'm gonna go in with a shimmer shade. Okay, I'm gonna go in with this other Juvia's Place um, palette, this one right here. I'm gonna go with the shade called Baroni. I'm actually gonna spray my brush with some Fix Plus so I can really make sure that pigmentation picks up. And this look is super basic. some slight glitter to really give it like that springy pop spring summer I don't know this to me is more summer but <laughs> and I'm trying to bring the color up a little bit just packing this on the okay now I'm gonna go in with some uh, glitter Okay, so the glitter, because I couldn't show you guys, it looks like this. This is what the glitter looks like, okay? And I'm not gonna use like a lot of it. I just honestly wanna just dab it. And with my NYX glitter glue. And I'm just gonna dab it with my finger. You can use any type of orange glitter of your choice. Like I said, I'm not going in with it heavy. I just wanna put some here and there. It's like really, really good. Like that, that's it. Next, I'm gonna go ahead and line my waterline. So first, I'm gonna line my waterline with a black eyeliner. All right, so before we do the bottom lash line and add the color, I'm actually gonna go ahead and apply my lashes. When you put the lashes on, it just really thing just like pop. Again, before we do the bottom part, I'm gonna go ahead and do my primer.
Bro, so as soon as I'm done with this, I am going to be watching WandaVision. Cannot wait. Let me go ahead and change my battery because it's flashing that it's about to die. So I'm gonna let this part sit anyway, so. Perfect. So I went ahead, I didn't even realize that I hadn't hit the record button. Um, I had to change my battery, but I did go ahead and blend out that concealer. That's pretty much all I did. Um, and now I'm just contouring. And if you're looking for a good like nose blending brush, the Sigma Precision Flat Angle P9 P88 brush is really good um, to blend out like nose contours and things like that because of the angle that it has. You can bake if you want to, but I'm going to use the num num whatever it's called. It'll be on the screen. I'm gonna bake probably, I know I just said I wasn't going to, but I'm gonna bake for probably just like a minute. I have a feeling this is gonna make me look, I don't know. Cause it gives me orange kind of vibes. I'm always getting makeup on my shirt. This is why I don't wear white. Like, it never fails, bro. Like, never. I don't know why I decided to use this one in particular today. But it doesn't look too bad. Ooh, my bronzer is all broken up. It's a disaster waiting to happen. Yeah, I would never use this shade again for my powder. So if you're my skin tone, I don't recommend this shade to do with. I just wanted to try it. This is just a brush that has no product on it. So we're gonna go ahead and the color underneath so i still don't know what color i want to do but i kind of want to do like a green for some reason like i really want to do green so i'm going to go in with my p louise palette and the worldy one i use these two green shades in the middle to do the bottom i'm gonna add more of the lighter green which is the color called baggage into it because i want it just a little bit brighter I'm gonna go ahead and add yellow in the inner tear ducts. I am with that same Zoo palette that I had recently used the yellow shade in. I'm really mad that I used that. Um... All right, so to me that looks pretty cute. Now I'm gonna go ahead and uh, do my mascara and then I'm gonna spray my face. To me, it's still giving me like 
I don't like so I'm just gonna kinda like while my face is still wet. Just really smush stuff in the skin. All right, now I'm gonna go ahead and add some blush because I think when you think of spring, I think of a little bit of blush. So I'm gonna go in with this e.l.f. blush palette. Um, it has like four different blushes in it and this is the one that I am gonna be using. I think I'm gonna go in with this one today. I think I'm gonna go in with this one today. I'm just gonna lightly put it on, nothing drastic. Okay. See, nothing too drastic. So I'm actually gonna be going in with my Artist Couture highlight. I have not been using this. I have straight abandoned it when I, like abandoned, I have abandoned it <laughs> when I bought the Juvia's Place one. And but I kind of missed this one, and so I am gonna use it. I just want to blind you guys a little bit more. Yeah, I think, I think I blinded you guys enough. I'm going to spray my face one more time. I'm using my Pore Professional um, spray. I want to go a little bit brighter with the pink. All right, so this is the finished look. So I really got, hope you guys enjoyed this spring look that I came up with for you guys. I'm definitely gonna be coming back with some more spring looks because it is my birthday month and I'm really trying to serve spring looks all month, okay? So definitely don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, share this video and all that good stuff and I'll see you guys in my next video, bye.